Insomnia not only lowers a person's energy level, but also impairs their mood, health, productivity and quality of life. Although adequate sleep time varies from person to person, generally adults need 7 to 8 hours of sleep. At some times, many people go into episodes of acute insomnia that last for days or weeks. This situation, which is mostly caused by stress or a traumatic event, is short-term and temporary. However, some people may experience insomnia for a month or more. The underlying cause of this condition, which is defined as chronic insomnia, may be insomnia itself, or it may be related to the drugs used, the person's general health and many other factors. In other words, there are many factors that cause insomnia. In order for existing insomnia to be defined as chronic insomnia, the person must show insomnia symptoms at least three times a week for at least three months. Before moving on to the symptoms of insomnia, one often wondered, what is insomnia? Must answer the question. Insomnia, which is also defined as insomnia among the people, is a common type of sleep disorder that makes it difficult for the person to fall asleep and stay asleep, and also causes the person to wake up early and have difficulty returning to sleep. Insomnia causes the person to feel tired when they wake up. It causes the coordination of the person to deteriorate during the day. In addition, both body and mental health of the person are affected by this situation. Insomnia is examined in two different types, acute and chronic. Acute, that is, the type of insomnia that develops spontaneously, is a condition that almost everyone can experience in their lifetime. In the presence of acute insomnia, a person may experience insomnia for a few days or weeks. This situation mostly develops depending on the stress level of the person and the traumas experienced during the day. However, some medications used and the person's general health condition can also cause acute insomnia. Chronic insomnia lasts longer. These people experience insomnia at least three times a week for at least three months. Insomnia can be caused by physiological and or environmental factors as well as psychological factors. Before moving on to the causes of insomnia, what are the symptoms of insomnia, must answer the question. What are the symptoms of insomnia? Some of the symptoms seen in the presence of insomnia, one of the types of sleep disorders, can be listed as follows, difficulty falling asleep, waking up earlier than expected, not feeling vigorous after sleep, being angry and aggressive, feeling tired and weak during the day, coordination and focus difficulties, difficulty remembering events, being sleepy during the day, worrying about sleep, increase in the number of mistakes and accidents made, hyperactivity, mood disorders, anxiety and depression. What causes insomnia? Insomnia can be seen only as insomnia without any other health problem, or it can also occur due to many diseases such as asthma, arthritis, depression, heartburn and cancer. In addition, drugs and alcohol consumption can cause insomnia. However, insomnia is mostly caused by events, stress, and habits that disrupt sleep patterns. Some of the common factors that cause chronic insomnia can be listed as follows, health problems, many ailments such as chronic pain, heart diseases, asthma, diabetes, gastroesophageal reflux, hyperthyroidism, Parkinson's and Alzheimer's can lead to insomnia. In addition, restless leg syndrome can prevent the person from falling asleep. Sleep disorders, some disorders such as sleep apnea, which can cause the person to stop breathing for a certain period of time during sleep, can cause insomnia. Psychological illnesses, like many types of mental illnesses that cause anxiety, depression alone can cause insomnia. Stress, problems and worries encountered in work, school or family life can cause the person's mind to remain active at night. In addition, traumatic events such as death, injury, divorce or dismissal cause an increase in the stress level of the person. All these factors associated with stress can lead to insomnia. Travel, situations such as jet lag, which are especially seen in intercontinental travel, cause the circadian rhythms that provide sleep and wakefulness to be disrupted. Disruption of this order, which can also be defined as the body clock, can lead to insomnia. In addition, working in shifts at short intervals can also cause insomnia. Lack of sleep pattern, sleeping and getting up at irregular hours causes the person's sleep pattern to be disrupted. Factors such as being active before going to bed, watching television, spending time on the phone and playing video games also cause sleep patterns to deteriorate. Such factors should be avoided before going to sleep, and such activities should be avoided in the bedroom.
Malnutrition. Eating late at night causes a person's sleep pattern to deteriorate as well as his general health. Fatty, spicy and heavy meals, which are eaten close to bedtime, cause discomfort such as heartburn and reflux, making it difficult for the person to fall asleep. It can also cause them to wake up at night. Drug use. Insomnia may develop as a side effect of some drugs used. Many medications can cause insomnia, such as antidepressants, blood pressure, asthma medications, and some types of pain relievers. In such cases, the physician should be consulted before discontinuing the drug use. Alcohol, smoking and caffeine use, consuming tea, coffee and carbonated beverages close to sleep may cause the person to have trouble falling asleep. Nicotine, another stimulant, can also cause a person to have sleep problems. Alcohol consumption can also prevent the person from sleeping deeply and can cause the person to wake up during the night. How is insomnia diagnosed? After the person suffering from insomnia consults the physician, the physician takes the history of the disease and performs a physical examination. The habits that cause the person to have sleep problems are questioned. The questionnaire, also known as the insomnia test, may be requested to be completed. In some cases, a sleep diary may be requested for several weeks. If deemed necessary by the physician, laboratory tests and hospitalization in the sleep center may be required. In the sleep center, the person is checked visually and audibly throughout the night. In addition, the person's breathing, heart rate, eye movements, body movements and brain waves are also examined. In the light of the findings obtained, the person is diagnosed with insomnia. How to treat insomnia? Insomnia treatment is performed by improving the underlying focal disease and or providing sleep patterns. In some cases, the physician may prescribe medication. In addition, cognitive behavioral therapy can also be applied to the person for insomnia treatment.